How they do the peeps and welcome back to the channel and something completely different this time We've got a challenge going on Got the Sony boys Me and the main man Mr. Stain <laughs> Against hey, hey, The Nikon Warriors The JPEGs <laughs> the, Ni the Nikon Warriors are actually powered by Sony Powering me up myself And you'll see that on the t-shirt they're wearing as well So I'll put on now what actually happened in the cafe And then We'll show you where we're going to Because We're near the Yorkshire Dales the welcoming party is just going up there So Gary got a bit excited So yeah <laughs> So yeah What we'll do as well We'll link everyone's channels below And let the battle commence Don't you be mother Go on Take a look there 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 Take a not a chance. No. It burned me on That's it. Yeah. Just even touching oh, a knock on it, yeah. just. Oh, oh, not a chance. It's a mistake. I know, I've just seen the way. I know, I know what we are. Just, oh, I've seen the channels. And I've never found the ears. What did they do? Get Sony. Sony scum. Sony? Yeah. Drink up with a lady. Why are we chatting with them? Well, that's not a bad idea. Yeah. 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 The needle's in a place. Yeah. It does make sure that gives you a lot. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty much. That garlic breast. Oh, guys. Nice to see you. Have you been touching a nickel? Yeah. Yeah. Jesus. How's your challenge, boys? Powered by Sony. What? A Nikon? Sony challenge. Yeah, I know. Is it, but that's an unfair advantage on us, surely. <laughs> we will see, won't we, Gary? Well, we, so shall we go somewhere? To I think we'll be absolutely perfect unless we've got a woodland. Where should we go? Well, why is <laughs> Why woodland? <laughs> because we've got an advantage of obviously a better system, right? You pick the location. How about that? And for sure that I'm, I'm not afraid of a challenge. We'll do a woodland. Eh? Darren, you pick the challenge. Pick the challenge. Location, got location. Can you, can you I've got the location. location. I've got a location in mind. Brilliant. Which will take you to. Okay. And there's, there's woodland. There's lone trees. Awesome. There's also a bit of limestone. Ooh, you like limestone? And the epic views of Yorkshire. Awesome. Nice. Okay. All there's only one, one problem. I haven't had my breakfast yet, so come on. Let's, let's take that. Let's, let's get as proud of it. So we tell you what. Grab your, grab your cups, come over here, have breakfast with us, Perfect. and then you can pay. Okay, love it. <laughs> <laughs> right, peeps. Obviously, it's a Nikon versus Sony challenge. We've got one location, which actually splits into two. If you want to know about the location, I scouted it yesterday. <laughs> But I think that video will be out after this because we're going to try and put all the videos out together so you can see them. But this location splits into two. Got the woodland to the left here, the scar to the right. But I'm just going to tell these Nikon, Nikon so called users to piss off a bit while I take my first shot. I'll put this first shot up now because these guys don't have a clue. <laughs> so. I'll see you in a bit. Right then, peeps. That's the first shot in the bag for the Sony team. So I'll bob it up now for you. Just let me know what you think about that one. I have got another one just around this corner. So I'll put number two in. And then, let's see what the Sony guys get up to. Because they're all just here. And the Nikon guys. So there we go. Got the welcoming committee. They're the sheep. Dave's got his flat cap on. So he's thinking he wants to blend in with the locals. So, but yeah. Let us know what you think about that first shot as we get these guys up to the top and then it's war time <laughs> <laughs> a 
for being cold cheats already, just because I've spotted something. So I'm going to show my fellow colleague, this way Steve. My fellow colleague, what I noticed yesterday when I was up here. Just so happens we wanted one location for us all. How are you finding this so far? I'll tell you what, it's good, isn't it? I'll tell you what. What location? We're going to wipe the floor with these two. <laughs> Nick, Nick on? Nah. You shouldn't say that. You, you never know, do you? you? never know. But we've got to pretend that we're really super confident. Yeah. This is what we are doing. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm super confident. Anyway. You never know. I'm going to show Steve this little little tree up here that you just can't. You've got to have Isaac back here up here. And obviously, them two Nikon users didn't see this on the way up. But we did. <laughs> Well, I did. So, yeah, it's not bad, but you get the grand vista as well. So, when I get there, I'll bobby back on. Right, peeps, quickly take you through this composition. I've done two versions. Obviously, we're in this challenge at the minute. So, Steve's with me on this one. Until we get to the main part, then we're going to split up and etch his bets, because we all know this sword is going to win, don't we? <laughs> anyway, I'll flick you around. On the, both versions, I've got this rock on the left hand side, just leading you up onto the tree that comes over onto the farm buildings down there. I mean, two minds whether to leave the farm buildings in, because the lower you get, you can lose them. But the lower you get, this really does come into the sky. And the sky is fantastic at the minute. And I also admit, you're liking this, aren't you? Oh. But I'll tell you what, working as a team on this, instead of going out individually, it, this is going to be fun, isn't it? It's, it's, I'll tell you what, what a laugh, all right. <laughs> yeah, so I'll pop this one up now. First two images. Do I really need to take any more? Comment below. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll meet them back in the pub anyway. I'll bump these on for you next as we. Try and catch the Nikon crew up. There is something that you want to us. So go come forward. You'll be Here we go, look. A Nikon warrior. Where is that? The right way around. Should be better beforehand. That's it. <laughs> Somewhere, typical somewhere, ni typical there's, Nikon user. Somewhere there's a village missing a signal. <laughs> right. We've got our two shots, but we want to come up to see these two, see what they're doing. But while I'm here, we might as well go into the woodland. Right, peeps, we have come up into the enchanted woods. And there's a distant number of thunder. I'm coming from a Sony user. <laughs> so yeah, this is the time now. We are probably going to split up. <laughs> this is the time now we are going to split up. Dave's just over there. Dave thinks he's got a shot already of some sheep shit. So, hmm, probably why he's got a nick on. So anyway, we are going to split up and get his next set of images. Right, the beeps. Left Steve over there, so we split up now, try and get some different images, ready for this competition. Anyway, Sony versus Nikon. All a bit of friendly banter, isn't it, all this? But what a laugh we're having here. Anyway, I've just lured Dave into a false sense of security, laid down, looking through something, looking through something to nothing. But he's going to think there's something there, because we were watching what we're doing, so... I've left him, left him around there, so we'll try and sneak up, up in a bit and see what he's up to. Anyway, the next composition. You know me with limestone. I've got this nice bit of limestone just here. Just so. There you go, look. A bit of limestone here. In the bottom, against that tree, just so it breaches the horizon. Yeah, took me fancy that. Just because the tree and the contrast stands out an absolute mile but at the minute i'm doing a lot of andel just to get down low and get that separation of it while these are over here 
I'm going to nip over and get a shot of a lone tree in a bit. But I'm going to go a bit further deeper into this woodland now. And then, yeah, <laughs> we'll sneak up on these Nikon guys. But for the time being, I'll bump this one up next for you. What have, I, what have I just been saying? I've just I've just lured Dave into a false sense of security there, look. I don't know you can see that or not on here. But Dave, Dave saw me on my hands and knees down there looking at this tree that gets buried. So hopefully he'll spend a bit of time wasting his time around there. <laughs> People may say it's dodgy tactics. Nah, it's just playing it to your advantage. It's one thing to be careful of when you come to places like this is careful of the limestone, especially when wet, and be careful of the wild, untamed Nikon user. <laughs> and we find it anyway up here. Oh, I love the location. I find it tough today. Can't see yet, but... But, but hopefully... What are you thinking of the place, though? Oh, the place is amazing. Yeah, absolutely. Yes. It just needs, it's harder to get that separation. Yeah, it's difficult, it is. Separated from other trees, but there's so many wonderful, wonderful trees. It's so, a place that has so much potential yeah. in it, really I've has. I've been using a wide out, I've been using a 14 to 30, but trying to the idea of getting the limestone yeah. and, and the leading trees, you down. But actually, what happens is the tree then gets lost in the background, yeah. so that isn't really working. So I'm going to change now to, a, to a, something with a telephoto on it. Um, Best thing for woodland? I yeah, that's there. It does work. I thought all this limestone around <laughs> might yeah. work, but it's not. So we're going to switch. Anyway, we're not going to tell him our little secrets, no, are we? Yeah. Right. <laughs> Be careful. Carry bear spray just in case. <laughs> <laughs> right then, peeps. I've pulled out a secret weapon. I've gone to the 7200 like I always do with woodland. But I think this is one of the images that's going to be going into this competition between us that we're having today. Um, something rather special. I have, I won't call it cheating, I call it improvisation. I've got the 70 to 200 on. I'm in at what, about 130 mil. And I'll, swap, I'll turn you around, you can see. Let me see if I can zoom in a little bit on here. There you go. I've got this tree just leaning over. Got this old feature gnarly tree just there. Comes over to this one on the right hand side. But at 100 mil, it really is compressing it. So I'm going to have to stitch it together. It'll be a three shot panel, I think, horizontal panel. Mm, I'm liking this. I'm also looking at how I'm going to process it. So I think it's a, I think it's a beauty. This is one I'm going to log for if there's any fog around here. Because this... Oh yeah, but this feature tree, just because coming out of the limestone, the gnarliness of it, everything. Mm. Anyway, settings wise, ISO 100, I'm on F9, I'm 40th of a second, I'm underexposing as well. Just to darken a little bit down a bit, because the actual ambient light is lighting up this tree. And the tree with it being a light bark and also very gnarly, it's just standing out. So anyway, I'll bob it on now, and let me know your thoughts below, because... I'm hoping none of these guys get it. <laughs> Not the Nikon guys anyway. So anyway, let's carry on because behind me, I'll show you, we've got some gnarly woodland covered in moss. peeps one thing about these challenges what a laugh we're having um, working as a team team photography this could be the future you know um, me and Steve both Sony users so we're on the same team one's gone one way I've come the other try and get something to put into this little this little competition with Suggy and Dave but let me just show you this if you know that you would learn photography oh my god whether I can get anything from here, because I'm going to be overwhelmed with this. 
but a shot I'm thinking of is just down here. Try and get a bit of separation around here. These old gnarly oaks. My God, it's... This place, this place is unreal. Um, this is going to be my new go-to place for the Yorkshire Dales, is this? Uh, yeah, I think I'm, I might even set the workshop group up from here. Because this is going to have everything for a workshop. So yeah, if you are interested, um, they'll be going from October. But yeah, let me try and get a shot. And when I have done, I'll come back to you. Because I'm going to work this. Because there's got to be an image here. Got to be. This is just unbelievable. Right, peeps. I've come a bit round that tree. My bag's just on the other side. But I might have to do a pano again. It's... <laughs> I'll show you anyway. I'm in right in these trees at 70 mil, just here. But the reason I want to do a pano is because this low lying branch at this side here, as you can see there, and then there's a low lying branch at the other side, which comes in. These are branches from this one that creeps in that I just might have to clone out. But my idea is I have the big cops in the middle of the frame and the branches at either side coming right to the edge of the image. Whether that's going to work or not, I don't know, but that's my theory about it. So, but also using the telephoto lens and being able to take this guy out of the equation. So yeah, bang at 70mm, 70mm panel all the way across. It's probably going to be four or five shots is this. That's my idea over it. <laughs> Whether it works or not, let me know below, because we've got to choose two images each. This is going to be hard. This is going to be hard as this, because I think we've both got some beauties so far, even in these flat conditions. But yeah, we'll see anyway. Let me know below what you think of this one. Well, peeps. I'm going to have to do it again. <laughs> I'm going to have to do a pano. But I'm going to show you why. <laughs> here we go. Let's zoom in a bit. We've got this tree here, just on the right hand side. And then it takes into account all this lot. All the way around. The luminous green boulders. Everything. But the focus is going to be on this tree in the middle. I focused on that tree at F9 to take into account all this lot. So again, I mean at what? What am I in at? Oh, bang on 100 mil. So yeah, <laughs> it's going to be a very messy scene, but I think it might just work. I've tried to get as much separation as I can between all the branches and that. And this one at the right hand side sort of leans in and grabs you. So. <laughs> Oh, I'm going to be spoilt for choice to eat. I mean, this place, it's blowing me away. Absolutely blowing me away. It's, yeah. I think I've got, don't need to go anywhere else now. I've found the spot to work. So I might even do a little project round here once I've had the op. So, yeah. <laughs> I'll bob this on anyway. And again, just let me know your comments below what you're thinking of this because it is blowing us all away, to be honest. Just work in this same area. As you can see there, this is the other side. So I'm trying to create some depth because there's no fog or anything. So I'm in at 70 mil again, looking at this scene, just with that big tree there, just slightly off centre, and the separation leads you through to the other side. So if this one's worked, I'll bob this one up next for you. This bit where I'm now just reminds me of Southern Scales. Great looking trees, 
but bloody hard to get a shot. <laughs> so anyway, what I've got so far, I'll bob up for you, and then we'll catch up with the others and see how the others have got on. So yeah, so for the time being, enjoy these images, and then I'll try and find everyone else. Look, my teammate. Do a good bit of editing, I think. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Did that winning shot work? No. Ah, no. <laughs> no, I'm a bit gutted. It definitely ain't worked. Right then, gents, how have we found it? Oh, I'm knackered. You're like, I'll just hear yeah. hats off to you. Both of you. <laughs> <laughs> that would be amazing. Don't know why they like, get that from me, it's just. I found it really, I found it, it's a fantastic location. Really interesting trees. Reminded me of Madeira, same thing earlier. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, but I found it very difficult today. I don't know why. I started with the 40 mil and then went to telephoto, and it was definitely better. But then I was just too tired, I think. But Nikon were great cameras. We looked at yours. Yours was awesome, wasn't it? Oh, my. Uh, Look, my, my Nick, Nick, Nikon. Anyway. Nikon are that good. <laughs> Look. <laughs> Powered by Sony. <laughs> right. So I think what we'll do. We're all going to choose a couple of images each. You'll have seen a lot of mine up already, but all the final eight images, I'll bottle them on the end now for you. I'm not going to put who the buyer out like that. If you want to vote for them, head on to the Facebook groups, the Thumbs Up Photography Group, Photo Peeps Group. Head on them, they'll be voting on there, so you can vote for your favourite, and yeah, I think the only winner today is photography, in it, chaps? Yes, mate, a company. Good yeah, yeah, big really cracking. That's the winner. Yeah, yeah. 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 I fell over twice, which is always yeah, a winner. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. So yeah. Anyway, enjoy all this lot. Thanks for watching. Give us the old thumbs up, and of course, hit that subscribe button. And from us all, bye bye, bye bye, bye bye. Bye, bye, bye bye. All the links are below for all the channels. So check these guys out as well for what they've been up to today. Because we don't know. <laughs> we don't know what they've been saying or doing. So yeah, <laughs> go check them all out. See ya, see you on the next one. Did you go receipt? For, did you bought out no receipt? I've got receipt, no. What's it say? It's legit, isn't it? It's not very one me up. It feels a bit cardboard. I haven't been back to the car, have I? It feels a bit cardboard -y. It's in the right, it's in the right bag, isn't it? Well, it's an A bag. Yeah. Not stuck, though. I'd go and have a word with him. Last thing you want to do is pull away and have a fine, do you? Yeah. 
Yeah, he's eating clowns. Is it? Isn't it voluntary? I've no idea. When we got here, I've done something similar like this before, when we got and here, I didn't go, and I ended up paying hundred quid. I can't actually remember that conversation where it went, but we got here, and it was. He said something like, "Do you have to pay?" Do you... So that's something about cafe. I wasn't listening. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> Dave has been stained here, big time. He has fallen for the parking ticket. Okay. He's gone. <laughs> he's, he's gone down. <laughs> he's gone down to the car to see if he's if he's been done or not. Because <laughs> we've told him he had to sign for receipts. <laughs> <laughs> He'll go back. Oh, so, we've been a fuck up. <laughs> Oh, just push, just push it too. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's fine. Watch your fingers. <laughs> oh yeah, plus we've parked in the farmyard. We've been in the farmyard, he's got a parking ticket. <laughs> he has a trick. Even though we have been down, like tea, cake, everything. I'll <laughs> find <laughs> 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 that is the wine now. He's a wine up. He's a wine up. Oh, I'm ruined it. He's a wine up. You bastard. Is that you? I couldn't have stopped laughing. I, I, knew, I, I knew. I ruined it. it. I, I knew, I knew, it was I knew a wine when up. he sent me a film. Who was it? Yeah. Was I, I can't that? say. I can't say. But when he sent me, I thought, he said, oh, man. Sorry, guys. I'll get you more. Sorry, guys. I started giggling. I let, I let Carr bag. Oh, dear. <laughs> <laughs>